So I today am going to tell you what a packing cube is good for and what a compression cube is good for and see which one you're looking for. Our first that we bought was compression cubes and I have always loved them. I've even turned some of my friends onto them and they said that they have totally changed how they pack and what they carry when they go on vacation. Now that being said, I wanted to talk to you because if you clicked on this video, most likely you're trying to decide do you want to buy some packing cubes or compression cubes and they are totally different in two totally different categories. The reason you would buy compression would be the fact that let's say you have a smaller suitcase and you're wanting to take more clothes than what could actually normally fit in. You can actually put in a good bit of clothes in a compression and it compresses it down and makes it where you can take more clothes. And if you want a video about compression, I will do, link that up here so that it kind of goes into more detail about a compression. But that is basically what you want a compression for. Now, if you're just looking for something to organize your clothes inside your suitcase, I think that the packing cube is the way to go. And a packing cube, we're not trying to maximize the space inside your suitcase. We're just trying to make it organized so that it's easier for you to grab what you need if you leave your stuff in the suitcase or if you take your clothes out of your suitcase and put them up it's easier to find them. For us we have the bigger suitcases so room is not an issue. When I would use the compression cubes I could pack way more in the suitcase than my 50 pounds that we would are allotted if we were going to fly on a plane and I would have to weigh them every time and then I would have so much room left inside the suitcase that things were kind of flopping around and it wasn't packed tight because everything was compressed down. Now, when it comes to packing cubes, what I really love about the packing cube is that you can fold your clothes in an envelope style and you can put them in the packing cube and then you can zip the cube up and when you get to where you're going, you can take that cube, unzip it, because in a compression, it only unzips half of the way, but a packing cube, it unzips all the way around so that you could fold the flap back. Then you can fold it back, and if you have like drawers or shelves that you want to put these clothes on, you can put them on there inside the cube and grab what you need out of the cube, where you can't do that with a compression. The compression, if you want the piece in the back, most likely you're gonna drag half the clothes out to get the piece in the back. But a cube, you totally can put them in the drawers. It still stays organized and you can get everything you want out of them. Now, another thing that me and Bill do, I have lime green packing cubes and that's what color all my stuff is in. And then Bill has the gray packing cubes so that when we look, if we happen to take the same suitcase, we can instantly look in there and see which piece I'm going to grab. Now, if you, depends on what kind of packer you are, there's multiple ways that you can organize your clothes. I put my top and pants together so that I know what I have and what I'm going to wear it with. Now, Bill, he is, puts all the shorts in one bag puts all his shirts in another bag. And that's how he organizes all his stuff. And personally, if you had a lot of interchangeable clothes, I think that's the really best way to organize these. That way you just got shirts and you just got pants. And if you need a shirt, you know which one to grab. And if you need a pant, you know which one to grab. And if you're that person, what I would suggest to do, just get a piece of ribbon in a certain color and tie tie on the handle that color and then you know oh wait this color is my shirts this color is my pants if that's kind of person i think that would be a great hack to know instantly which one has got your shirts and which one's got your pants i think that's the better way but that's just not how my brain works i have to put them together and then it's just easier for me that way 
Now I do, for like my underwear and bras, I do use the compression for those, just because they're, it's smaller, it compacts up, and typically, I'm not digging through trying to figure out which pair of underwear I'm gonna wear. I just grab a pair and use them. A packing cube, I feel like they fit in your suitcase so much better because you can file them standing up and they just, they fit because it's a cube. Where the compressions, it compresses them down so much and sometimes they won't lay in your suitcase just like stacked perfectly. It leaves gaps and rooms in your luggage because of the way they're like an egg shape. They're not really an egg shape, but it's fat in the middle and then it gets narrow on the edges. So it kind of leaves a little bit of room in your suitcase and they don't sit in your suitcase as well. But again, if you're trying to get maximize the amount of clothes that you can get in the suitcase, compression is totally the only way I would suggest to do that. I hope this video helped you decide which one that you want to go with and I will leave you my favorites in the description box below. These are affiliate links and they do help us make more videos. Till next time, like and subscribe.